So last time we were in a bit of bind because there were like a huge amount of troopers uh, battling down towards the chopper of Malik and we need to save her. And we need to be uh, pretty fast. So let Don't be a sitting duck. Maybe, maybe not. But this is your best chance to slip by them unnoticed and you know it. So get out of here, Jensen. Okay, Q was the right. Okay, now I'm much faster. Luckily, <laughs> those are waiting. I need to strangle one of those. Those. Okay, uh, I need to use this grenade. I don't know why it didn't work out so well, but I pressed the key button. Okay, that sniper is... Where's the last? Ah, he's he's up there, up there. Don't make me. Jensen, the bird's fixed and I'm taking off. Okay. I get on with the that, damn mission. That doesn't look really healthy, Thanks. but. Bye, boy. Okay. <laughs> Stun gun is the best. I mean, I mean, really, really is. Now they are sleep, sleeping nicely. That feels like he's dead. Yeah. He's dead. Oh no. no. Okay. I think he dies to the explosion. So okay, so we we kind of uh, did uh, made out that yeah, it, it was this guy actually died with the explosion of the uh, robot. So and this guy is actually sleeping. So, I don't think it's going to be counted that uh, I killed this guy. Because I, I stunned him. And I threw a non-lethal weapon, which is, which is, well, an EMP grenade. So, unless he had, like, a pacemaker, I don't think it's going to be, like, an issue. But, yeah, I, I think we managed that well. Despite that one guy died. Guy died. Not our fault. It's slow elevator because you could actually see if you are just running, you can see how your friend's chopper actually Jensen, explodes. I've been monitoring calm activity around Hengsha. Bell Tower's looking for you. Hard. I know. They ambushed us, Pritchard. Forced us to make an emergency landing. Malik barely got away in time. But they're supposed to be. The good guys? Just. Give them a wide berth, Jensen. If they recognize you, they'll shoot. Ouch. Okay, that lady f fell down. Ouch! He's alive. So, surprisingly, everyone gets a migraine. <laughs> Good.
continues that like something something didn't happen. You must have felt it too, right? Everyone who was augmented has been getting strange symptoms. I I can't speak to you right now. Something is wrong. Please, sir. Do you know what is happening? Maybe I should actually visit the limp It's Richard. Have you been watching the news? No. Nope. A bit busy, Francis. Jensen, the World Health Organization is advising all augmented patients to check in with Lim. There's a problem with biochip technology. The glitches I've been experiencing. We've all had them. So far, I can't determine why. You heading to a clinic? I'm running a few more tests. But since I can't exactly run them on you, and we don't know when you'll be back, you might not want to wait. Up to you. That one guard me, uh, almost spotted me. Maybe they don't like me. Which is very p possible. Yeah, name's Jensen. I will tell surgery. You find something else? Depends. Practice kit. Yes. I'm ready. Okay, so it's a major, major surgery. And considering like how many people are having having augmentations, this is like major undertaking. Everyone gets up upgrade. Let's hope it's as good as they say. Mr. Jensen, right? Thank you for your time. I am Meng Yao, an associate of Mr. Darrow's. I'm in charge of one of his divisions here in Hengsha. You come highly recommended. Really? Your boss described you as a most precious asset. Apparently, you are very efficient and always get the job done. We could definitely use a man like you for this operation. An asset, huh? I guess that's the right word. I can't say I'm a big fan of being shoved around and shared like a stapler. A state-of-the-art multi-million dollar stapler. Ah, Mr. that Jensen. makes it all better. There's no reason to be insulted. I'm an asset too. And if my employer considers me valuable enough to recommend my services to a friend, I would be honored. What is it you want? We need you to help us stop a group of terrorists who are threatening the Panchea project. Are you up to it? Okay, I'll help out. Excellent. Here's the situation. It has come to our attention that these terrorists possess highly classified proprietary information about Panchea. We've been able to convince them to sell it to one of our agents, a man named Lo Fei. The meeting is supposed to take place near the Alice Garden Pods in the Daigong district. And you want me to crash this meeting? Actually, there will not be a meeting. We are sending you alone to ensure Mr. Fei's safety. The terrorists will not be expecting that, and will have the information with them on a data chip. You have to neutralize all of the sellers and retrieve the chip so you can bring it to ah, me. Ah, all right. I don't get it. If Fei set up the meeting, why risk sending me in his stead? Why doesn't he or even some of your other agents drop in on the sellers and take the chip? Because Mr. Darrow wants an absolute guarantee that there will be no casualties. We will not play by their rules. We want them arrested and questioned, then properly prosecuted and sentenced. This will require stealth and efficiency. That's why a man with your particular skills will be indispensable. Anything else I need to know? The sellers are expecting Mr. Fay and Mr. Fay alone. If they spot you, they will shoot on sight. Need I point out this might make your job a lot harder? Story of my life. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, this was the meeting location.
doing a bit matrix here. One practice. Uh, he's sleeping in the mud. Okay. Here's the contact. You must get that chip back, Mr. Jensen. I got the chip. The sellers are out cold. Excellent work. Seems Mr. Darrow was right to trust you. We will send people to take care of the terrorists. Could I see the chip? How about you tell me what's on it first? Blackmail, Mr. Jensen? Don't waste your time. I won't tell you anything. Besides, there are stones better left unturned. Might as well just give me the chip and leave it at that. Okay, only... Oh. Look, you're a powerful young woman. <laughs> you're in a position that warrants your access to classified information. I understand that not everybody should get their hands on this, but I'm like you. I work for a powerful man and I get entrusted with secret information on a daily basis. Plus, I'm the one who busted his ass getting this chip for you. I guess your point is not entirely without merit. But understand, this information is extremely confidential. Okay. It concerns Panchea, and more specifically, the Hiram Project. Hiram Project? Never heard of it. I'm not surprised. It is a well-guarded secret. But without it, Panchea could not exist. Such an ambitious project. An installation extending all the way to the ocean floor. The pressure exerted against it is constantly shifting. Yet the slightest defect in structural integrity could bring it all down. That's why we needed something powerful and extremely efficient to monitor it day and night. AI. You're saying the Hyron project is some kind of advanced computer? Yes, I suppose you could say that. Thank you for your honesty. The information is safe with me, don't worry. Here's your data chip. Ah, perfect. You don't so know what this ladies, means, man. Mr. Jensen. <laughs> your help has been invaluable. Thank you. Even though this was a favor for Mr. Darrow, he believes you should be duly rewarded. Here is a payment in credits. I'm sure Mr. Darrow will wish to congratulate you himself. Expect to hear from him soon. Hey. Arvatko Jari, mikä vuosi tässä pelissä on menossa? Can you, can you guess Jari, what, 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 the, what the year is in, a, in a, this, this game? It seems David has a flair for choosing his people, Mr. Jensen. You have done me a great service today. Glad I could help. Couldn't let information about something as sensitive as the Hyron project get in the hands of the wrong people. No. No, we couldn't. So, Meng Yao told you about the project, I see. A little. I am afraid words can't do it justice. To fully comprehend the ramifications of what's been created in Panchea, you'd have to see it for yourself. And who knows? Perhaps one day you will. Perhaps we have... It's our last, last mission in this game. This isn't the place for you, my friend. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, almost uh, the year in in the game isn't 1990 it's more like 2027 <laughs> ah okay delay delay one minute delay yeah that that, that can be e easily depends how how many Places the signal is being routed through. through. they are doing nice mask no 
That's far enough, Guaylo. That guy. Tom. You disappoint me, Jensen. I thought we were friends. Then my hacker goes missing. You break into my place of business, and you don't even have the manners to knock when you enter a room. Well, I actually I knocked many skulls. You. <laughs> and you reason I don't just turn you over. Yeah. Vasily Savchenko. Never touch the stuff. You're wearing his arm. GPL device inside it. Let me straight to you. Scavenged tech. Get you every time. Wrong woman, don't do that here. Sorry to say, the man I got this from wasn't in a position to complain. Bell Tower gave us his corpse a few weeks ago. Okay. Bell Tower? Not Tai Young? Tai Young's not the one grabbing people off my streets and giving me choice arg, so I close my eyes. Sevchenko had four okay. other Okay. I'm not wearing any of them. So maybe they're still alive, and maybe I help you out with this. Go on. I've got a pretty good idea where Bell Tower's been dragging people. Problem is, bastard's got my son. And he gets a bullet if I step out of line. See where I'm going with this? Where's he being held? Uh, One of my harvester boys will bus. tell you all Good. about it. Meet him in the sewers near the Alice Garden Ponds. Alice then, Garden Ponds. when you free my boy, come back and we talk some more. I can hardly wait. <laughs> I can hardly wait. Okay. He's a bit down. Laser rifle. Ooh. This is interesting place. I wonder. I wonder what boys are doing with the uh, with the uh, surgical equipment and the bomb. Hey, hey! I know you. You the one Bell Tower. Okay, who's who is this guy? I seen your picture. You got the wrong guy. What's it worth to you for me to think so? Be a simple thing for me to yell out. Maybe a few credits to keep my mouth shut, huh? How about I find some other way to keep it shut? Permanently. That, Tough guy. That won't be necessary. I see now that you're much taller <laughs> than the man they're looking for. I thought you might see things that way. <laughs> now move it. Have a man got a whole cover here. And once again we are in a sewer. And I don't know why, why the game designers love to make sewers, but hey. I think it's a, some kind of tradition in, in a game design. Yo, toy, you okay. were tongues, boys. No. Yeah, the bot, bot like doesn't want to ask to post links. Any other stupid questions? Because this Not is yet. like public but chat. Come up with one, I'll be sure to ask. Where's the kid? We thought he was in the upper city. Hold up nice and tight inside the bell tower compound, but as it turned out, the fox got nervous. Didn't like the look of Tong's flex stick, so they moved his son someplace safer. What could be safer than inside bell tower headquarters? You're about to find out, my friend. They're holding him just around that corner in the basement of an old noodle factory. Won't be easy getting him out either, because the men guarding him aren't your typical bell tower police. These are warriors, specially trained. Heavily augmented. I have a feeling I may have met them before. If that's the case, you got an escape plan? You are the escape plan, my friend. Didn't Tong tell you? If Beltal finds out anyone else is involved, things are going to get very ugly in Lower Hensha. So Tong's willing to risk his kid's life on one man's abilities? Not necessarily. When you get to Tong's son, give him this. He'll know what to do with it. Now get going. Wouldn't want you to miss your next ride. Satan taas puhua ehkä omasta, omasta, omasta niin kokemuksesta, niin se on tosi ikävä juttu. Et, et jos sä teet niin, kuin, niin sanotusti niin hyvää työtä omasta mielestä, mutta ei saa tehdä työtä hyvää työtä jostain syystä tai enää tarvitse resursseja tehdä sitä. Heittinen tiet. Jop. Tiedän kyllä. Yeah, I'm just... 
I'm just talking because that's that's my job. I'm I'm like, hey, I'm a streamer. I'm just uh, talking talking whatever I comes to mind because that's what streamers do. Just just talking to talk, keep keep these gums flapping. Access granted. Okay. Then we have a time to stage a great escape. You dumbs kid. So my mother keeps telling me. <laughs> but you So are my mother Delta keeps Howard, telling me. Chinese. Am I to assume my honored father is covering his back by sending you in to spring me instead of his harvesters? Wise assumption. Let's get out of here. I don't think so. Last time I checked, Bell Tower had a lot of firepower out there. I'm not willing to risk my neck on the unlikely possibility that you neutralized all of it. No offense, American. None taken. I wasn't crazy about the odds myself, but when I questioned it, I was told to give you this. Well, well. <laughs> Way to go, father. This changes everything. Assuming they reassembled it correctly. You ready to go? Tell me something first. How the hell was Bell Tower able to nab you? Whatever do you mean? Come on, kid. I may not be 100% up on the triads, but I'm betting your dad's not far from becoming a dragon head. I find it highly unlikely that the local authorities could just waltz in and take off with his son. Under normal circumstances, you would be right. But in this case, I'm the one who walks over to them. You volunteered to be kidnapped? Why? Let's just say, my father and I do not share the same love of organizations. Uh... I find them dangerous and not something our family should be putting so much trust in. But father expects me to... How do you say it? Follow in his footprints? So a change of scenery is required. I'm not following you. Tong Si Hong would never willingly allow his only son to leave his side. I needed a way to convince him that I had to leave Hongsha immediately. So you orchestrated the kidnapping. You're playing with fire, kid. By pitting the triads against Bell Tower, you've put the entire population of Lower Hangsha at risk. That... may be true. But you are here to rescue me, aren't you? So my plan seems to be working this far. Right. And sometimes, the more power you think you have, the more quickly it slips from your grasp. I will... try to remember that, American. Are you ready to go now? I feel a lot more confident about things if I knew what the device was, and exactly what you intend to do with it. You mean they didn't tell you? Not surprising, I suppose, given how much Father enjoys his little secrets. I assume you've noticed how his harvesters like to repurpose existing technology? If you mean steal it from other people and sell it to new customers, then yeah, I noticed. Not necessarily a practice I approve of, but not everything gets resold. Sometimes it is taken apart and reassembled into something more useful. A handheld version, for instance, that doesn't need to be implanted in the human body to work. You're still not telling me what that thing is. Easier if I just show you. So. Shall we leave? Yeah, but stick close. Your father and I have some unfinished business to take care of, and it all goes to shit if I don't get you back to him in one piece. Don't worry about that. I'll make sure father sticks to his promise. Maybe even get him to throw in a little extra. But as grateful as I am for your assistance, from here on in, it's every man for himself. See you later. Yeah, <laughs> called it. Nice view, by the way. I don't know how how structurally sound that is, but anyway.
recommending, but I don't want to buy for some reason. Like Yaku Yakuza game. I'm, I'm right now doing like third Yakuza game. Yakuza Kiwami 2. And it's going to be a YouTube, YouTube uh, only play series. So I, I can actually play it, play it whenever I like. Okay, last game. That had had like warning that. By the way, this is <laughs> this is randomized. Don't expect sure this be fair. Tong, how did you get this frequency? Ancient Chinese secret. Now listen, you're going to plant that package in Administrator Wang's office. Put it on the bastard's desk and trigger it. Sound good? Sounds like I'm doing you a favor. How does it help me? The explosion should distract the guards. Then you hop in a cargo pod and off you go. But you only got one shot. No turning back once you trigger that thing, you get me? I got you. Only set it if I'm ready to go. Okay, now we play, uh, blow, blow this thing up. Activate bomb. You will even eventually win when you, even if your skills are not good, so they are more satisfying. Yeah. They, you, you, you can actually... Uh, Shit! That's a fast bomb. Oh no. Personally, I don't like permadeath in games, but I think it's a stupid mechanic like hardcore runs in games. Yeah, Iron Man mode, basically. Yeah, Iron Man mode. Once again, if you are, l are looking something to challenge your in your life, and you play games for challenge, I'm, I'm kind of understanding it. But some people are not looking looking to be to, to ch get challenges that they need to actually overcome. <laughs> yeah, adrenaline from it. Yeah, that's what the one thing, one thing definitely. Okay, the boy is so running. The distraction wasn't just for me, was it, Tom? The trace. <laughs> Richard, I'm going up the grid for a while. Not sure how long. Why? What are you up to, Jensen? Following a lead. And where exactly is this lead taking you? You there! Get that cargo, clear the fire! We're pulling out now! Load and secure those bonds! Answer me, Jensen. Where are you going? Hell if I know, Pritchard. Hell if I know. <laughs> Adam Jensen is making a leaps of faith in this game. I mean, really long leaps of faith. And I think I don't think it paid out for him. Curious who she might be. Who are you? And what are you doing on my ship? Bell Tower keeps two ships in port. They're going to plant that package in Administrator Wang's office. I don't like. I, li I like to have a challenge in a game, but I don't want to use my time and then die and erase it all. So I prefer some some kind of progression. Yeah, definitely. You're the cruise director. Some kind of complaint. <laughs> you complaint. think you're funny, do you? Well, let's see how funny you feel after Lieutenant Kaifu gets through with you. Lieutenant? It's useless to resist. This chair has a built-in EMP field generator. Your augs are nothing but dead metal right now. Is that so? No doubt they will have reset to Factory Zero. You need a limb clinic. You can't have it both ways, you know. You can't play the good cop when you've been playing the bad cop. <laughs> you think you're clever, don't you? But this ship is heading to a Bell Tower naval base. 
a military facility for the confinement and interrogation of unprivileged belligerents. And when we get there, we're going to take you apart. You'll have to get me there first. You're outnumbered and outgunned. I don't think it'll be a problem. Still, when they found you in that cargo container, you did manage to take out a number of highly trained men. Tell me something, Hotshot. Do you enjoy taking people's lives? Not if I'm given the choice. Oh, but you had a choice when you decided to blow up our port. Don't know what you're talking about. Like hell you don't. We may not know who you are yet, but Burke's running your profile as we speak. High-grade combat spec augmentations, built to be somewhat unnoticeable so you blend in with the civs, someone spent an awful lot of money creating you. Lucky me. So I guess the real question is, are you a terrorist? Or some kind of corporate thief? Would you be happier if I told you that I'm neither? You have absolutely no idea of the shit you're in, do you? Rifleman Bank Station is a black site. It's off the grid. No one will come and rescue you. No one even knows where it is. You'll be dropped into a deep, dark hole and never see the light of day again. Stew on that for a while, tough guy. Not going too well. Do you play any multiplayer games? I'm kind of looking up for a game that has a join in matchmaking with games. Don't take that long. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. I'm not the right guy to ask uh, about that. Richard. I mean, sure, sure, multiplayer games with with friends. Nice. We are getting getting free. It's easier to program than than PVE. But some some kind of horde shooting game might be might be your ticket. But I'll 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 think about it if if I can find find some of the game games. Because you are sure you are correct that they there's there's not many many games that are like like that massive three multiplayer. Let's not get caught this time, by the way. By the way, watch yourself. If you go and choke on unlawful belligerents like you just did in front of the wrong guy, you might join him in lockup. So shut up and keep watch. Huh? No, you could didn't see me. To Charlie. Come on. Anomalous reading in sector D6. Monitor. Someone? Come on. Come on. Damn. Did I get him before he's at the camera side? myself in the internet like I would do in real life. Yeah, that's what I try to teach to people, but... So, so I would say that internet persona that we have is a construct of many things. And currently in our time and age, it's pretty important that you have like well constructed internet persona or online persona rather, which Anyone might be here? a part of the like LinkedIn and other other public sources. 
but thing is that you need to like decide but what what do you want to be what kind of guy you want want to be or girl That's true, I've gone into contact with that also. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't see that, see that text. Oh yeah, I had a manager throw me middle finger while just asking common question. I was, what the fuck, he's holding a middle finger against me. Looking around to other workers, they all just uh, gave his away and let him do it. I was thinking about going... Uh, going for the upper management, I did. I decided not to, since I was leaving sooner. Th uh, anyways, so yeah, that's like if you are like social justice warrior, you are going to like go go nuts for that. But then again, if it's like your about your mental health and your your life, then I would like advise no, advise not to. Because it's... yeah. So I get, couldn't get the laser rifle with me. Okay, so we are back in the small inventory, but we have like... What? No ammo. No ammo. Oh no, we slowly and... Uh, methodically. Carefully, carefully. Unstable load. Stasis pod. Apparently, there's Somali pirates in in twenty twenty seven. forward now I feel like AI, AI is enabling people without for example artistic skills to have a chance for example there's a cool idea for a game he knows the coding and stuff but lacks artistic skill he might use an AI to generate them instead of hiring artists yes exactly so we we kind of experiment with the AI in the last game jam uh, we made a family three mystery game called family three mystery and it was like uh, we used two pictures. We first we generated uh, pictures of grand f grandparents, and then we actually uh, combined both pictures in a mid journey and made like grand uh, uh, children to them, and uh, generated uh, spouses for the children uh, who had them, and combined their picture and made a grandchildren for them. So we had like uh, super super detailed. Uh, super detailed simulation of family uh, with, uh, without actually actually using much much of time and that that was like weekend weekend birth birth of work so I'm I'm actually seeing a lot of, lot of use uh, uh, with with AI in a game development just because we are kind of very limited on resources always and need to actually deliver something so so yes this that's definitely one one way to look at it uh, AI as an en enable to enable something and it's it's not wrong of course, enabling somebody to uh, like do a uh, 
deep fake porn about somebody, be, some be person who doesn't want it. That's that's wrong. But that, that's like ethical question, pretty normal ethical question. Yeah, I I, I saw chat GPT with the Skyrim uh, <laughs> NPCs and it it was really really cool. I I really liked it. Like the idea that, but it's like, it's it's also a modded game, so it's not going to be like, <laughs> yeah, companies that like Bethesda can't can't use it like that, but they they can actually do something similar. Ah, I can get out from here. Like GPT two, two or three older version chat, chat GPT basically. Those would be like really good uh, generators from from the NPCs in, in uh, role playing games like a Skyrim. AI generated continual quests for games for the win. I would love I would love to say I AI generated new quests to open world games. After you beat the main quest, yeah, because fact is that uh, as for game, as for games, they are very often very simple code, and uh, because uh, examples are that uh, when when you have uh, like very difficult code. Okay, we are breaking up. Okay, we are back in the pro broadcast. Let's check. Yeah. We are connecting. Yes, we are back. We are back. So, what was I saying? So, the code is difficult. And and if you are trying to do co do complex things, they don't usually don't either serve the game or they break down. And there's lots of examples what, when when this has been the case uh, in games. But uh, as for for the mm, branch of technology, the game the industry is always using the latest technologies. Even if they are like not really good for or not re really in innovative, like you can remember those uh, cameras that actually track the mode mod motion, like Kinect. Yeah, Kinect. Kinect was the, was the uh, technology that was uh, used in the Xbox, but really didn't didn't fire up. Francis Pritchard isn't going to be hearing you anytime soon, Bratan. Not only this close to the base, he's jamming already. Who the hell are you? Someone who's gone to a lot of trouble to make your escape look like accident. I was hoping you wouldn't call quite so much attention to it on your way to this room. But one works with the tools he has. Can't see the messages the from Elbow YouTube. Bay. Find the sally port there and enter it. You're going to encounter more resistance. But the longer you stay undetected, the better off your future will be. Activating security scan. That's what happened. I wonder what's happening. <laughs> Biometric data assembled. Hmm. Kyllä. Yeah, 
yes, Twitch is, Twitch is much, much better in it. Sadly, no way can set the base on alert. I may be able to buy you some time, but... So, you're a hacker. There's a maintenance tunnel in loading bay one. Access to a floor panel. Get inside. Follow the cables and try not to kill the person inside. Access granted. Okay. No need, but the others too. Kuvitteli, että mä oon ihan eri paikassa. Toi näyttää kipeältä. Shall we find our hacker from here? That's far enough, Jensen. That you that girl behind this? I said that's far enough. I can explain everything if you just stay where you are. Why don't you put the gun down? Then maybe we can talk. <laughs> you think I'm stupid? You've got every reason in the world to hate me, and I've heard what you do to your enemies. Tell me, did you enjoy putting so many BT contractors into comas? Yes. You're the one who let me off the leash. It wasn't my choice. As a matter of fact, I think you're going to get us both killed before this is over. But if we'd left you in that brig, who'd be around to save your Dr. Reed? What do you know about Megan? I know the name set off way too many bells and whistles when I added it to Burke's profile search on you. But it helped me to figure out who you are and why you stowed away on the ship. You think Bell Tower kidnapped her, don't you? You want to tell me you didn't? I wish I could. But after what I've seen this past year, all I know for certain is she's not on the base. Not anymore. What's that supposed to mean? Not what you're thinking. Listen, Rifleman Bank Station supports all Bell Tower operations in this region, Jensen. Regular contract and special op. Six months ago, I received orders to pull every regular great soldier and civilian contractor away from the airstrip. Two Black Hawk helicopters set down minutes later. I thought it had to do with Australia, especially when I saw covered stretchers coming out. How many? Five. Guarded by a heavily augmented special ops team. Burke went out to meet the leader and the whole group disappeared inside the detention camp. There's some kind of black project going on in there, Jensen. Something involving prisoners and scientists. And I need you to find out what it is. Why me, Keitner? That is your name, isn't it? The one Burke used back on the ship? Natanya Keitner, yes. And it has to be you, because any movements I make are noted and logged. I can't risk blowing cover. Cover? Who are you working for? A few months ago, an Interpol agent approached me. They've had Bell Tower on their radar for some time, but they've never been able to prove anything. The things that agent pointed out about this base, it opened my eyes to a lot of things. So you see, Jensen, I really am playing the good cop and the bad cop. 
I'm gonna need more information than that. Tell me about this black project. I wish I could, but it's been classified. So classified every BT suit I talk to refuses to even acknowledge its existence. But you've seen something. Only the edges. This station is part base, part military stockade, and every week a new shipment of belligerents arrives. Only, Interpol says they're not on anyone's terrorist watch list. Most are just civs. Harmless civs. Burke takes them into a restricted wing of the detention camp, and they just disappear. Tell me more about these scientists. Technically, I'm in charge of operations here, so I keep tabs on people coming in and out. Burke keeps meeting with doctors and researchers, telling me it's part of his interrogation technique. You got any names? None that I trust, unless the Doe family suddenly expanded into Australia and Asia. Thing is, I don't always see how they leave. Yet you're sure that Megan did? The Blackhawks did. Without the stretchers, but loaded with five stasis pods this time. Fine. What do you need me to do? Hold still for a second. What the? Relax. I'm just compiling your biometric signature. Retinal scan, pulmonary and vascular imaging, the works. Once I upload it to the network and give Corporal Alan Tyler a security rating, you'll be able to pass through specific checkpoints in this sector. Only this sector, why not others? Because you're a fugitive, Jensen. The less room I give you to maneuver in, the more likely it is you'll stay one. I can get you into the detention camp, but the interrogation wing is going to be a problem. Only Bert can give clearances for that. And I assume you don't want me to go ask for one. Still the comedian. There's a security mainframe inside the detention camp central command tower. You'll need to upload this copy of your biometrics there by hand. Contact me using your infolink once you do. Any more questions? The guards in the prison complex, are they Burke's men or yours? Definitely Burke's. Highly trained, special operatives. So if you start a firefight in there, don't expect to live long. I'll keep that in mind. I could use some more hardware. Any chance Corporal Tyler will have access to the armory? You're still a fugitive, Jensen. I suggest you keep a very low profile. Still, there is someone who might be able to supply you. One of the base mechanics, a civilian named Quinn. He runs a nice sideline in procurement. I know the type. Why should I trust him? Because I do, and because he has no love for Burke. He's in the lower level maintenance area near the elevator. He'll get you what you need. I'd like a little clarification here about you and Burke. I take it he outranks you. Technically, yes. But this station is only part military stockade. And while he and his unit have 100% control over the detention camp, I have authority over the base. So I don't need to worry that this is all just some creative attempt at mutiny. Mutiny? You think I'd risk so much because... Listen close, Jensen. Burke is a sexist, <laughs> chauvinist pig. And yes, he outranks me. He's also been in Bell Tower a lot longer than me, so he's got more connections. Which he's used to undermine me at every turn. But that is not why you and I are standing here right now. People are getting hurt. Innocent people. And we have to find out why and expose it. Exposure could destroy Bell Tower. Bell Tower used to have honor. We do this right, it might again someday. That's all I need to know. Good. I'll upload to the security network from here, so get going. Alan Tyler will exist by the time you reach the prison security port. Just be careful and try not to draw too much attention. Alright.